Hello YouTube and fellow Wacom tablet users. Um, I here have a very old tablet from Wacom. It's the Bamboo Pen CTL470. It's like a bottom line version of already old product. It's obsolete. They don't make drivers for it anymore. The latest version is from 2015 I, I think. And I have some issues with that driver. Um, when I boot up my desktop it's like this and if I then start to draw on in Fire Alpaca, that's the uh, application that I'm using, this happens. Like, that's you can't draw like this. I don't know what's going on, some f uh, issue with the drives I guess, with Windows 10 or whatever. I don't I have not, I don't have another operating system so I can't test it in other driver, uh, other operating systems. Anyway, the solution I found for this very quickly is that when you go to Task Manager, uh, let's close this one quickly, it's annoying me. Alright, when you go to Task Manager, you can see there's a, a few tablet services that those are created by Wacom. Um, if you close these processes and everything related to Wacom um, and then restart the, the, the service from Wacom, it fixes the problem that I'm having. Um, but I'm lazy and I don't want to go into Task Manager and close every process by hand every time this happens. So I made a little tool for you, um, or for me, exactly for me and you can just use it if you want to. It's very simple, it just closes the processor that starts with uh, the name pen, because that's the actual process name, and then it restarts them. That's it. So I'm going to do that now. And you just can see it's closing those processes and then it will restart them. Ta-da! And if you go back to the drawing program, you, s you, know, you shall now notice that it works. can't draw at all. <laughs> Why do I even have a tablet? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I hope this solves your problems as well, and if it doesn't then uh, I'm sorry for it. For it. See ya.